Okay, like Apex here, and today we'll do the other figure thing I was talking about. Also, I didn't I kind of switched out how the certain legs work in some of my ghouls. So, next thing y'all see them like in the image or whatnot, their legs will be a little different and more acceptable. <laughs> anyway, so here's what I guess I'm just gonna call the being. So, I use whatever spare parts I had to build these creatures. It's actually, it's, this is actually two things put together. But I'll show you, this is the ultimate form of the being. Which, um, yeah, I'm just going to call it the being. Well, in low tip, when I had, I thought I was thinking like, oh, we, they, they get all like, what's this, 15, 15 blades together and they summon this thing for like power. It's like, God, Dragon Ball Z thing works. But yeah, this is the being. And so, for like scale, the being is like this height. Alright, so here's the being. For full view. Or auto being. The being. Alright. And then. Now, I am going to go articulation. This video is not going to be long, but I want to show um, the being. Them when being is split form. Go articulation in. So you have the being in this split form, and you have the um, its little counter. So we'll go over the being no longer in its ultimate form first. So the being, I was trying to go like some type of flesh organic robot like creature. Do so we have the being? Oh, it's all quadruped. Well, it's I could I think I could actually pose it up, standing up. Like I could think I'm pretty sure I could actually pose it to being standing up. So it'll be like knuckle wrist, right here. So the being itself, the being has neck rotation right here to go side to side, rotation here, left, right, extend their mat. These do can go up and down so he could eat something or drain it of his life essence. Um, it has a rotation of the arm to rotate back and forth, back and forth, and then it has the rotation of this, rotation, and then you have the claws that fit here so it can dab if it wanted to or just like use martial arts um it has this his leg articulation is going up and down side to side you know because it's ball it's ball jointed and then you do this and do this and then you have the phone the foot or that you know what i'm saying you have this and that so that's how the being is set up you know, another thing we saw is the form, but I'm not sure you're going to see it's all the form over again. Posing, or the same, because, like, there'll be some pieces I'm going to be taking for this to amplify one of the, um, my ghouls. To switch out some of the, like, um, the more arachnid like legs. Seeing how now I can do what I want with certain pieces. And make it all actually even. Now, this is what I like to dub. It's a war scout. I'm saying. Now, I be I built the being first, and then I did the war scout. And then I have like form sports guy says the war scout is oh 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 now you're stable there we go like it's kind of not stable no but it looks like it got better than before and then you know after this and then I was like wait a minute I can combine this you know I may may or may not still have to be trade with my brother I don't know maybe I'll trade this for his mongoose I don't know I mean another vehicle against the war I mean base building I feel like that's fair anyway so um the 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 war scout if I can sorry. I had to do that drip on there. Anyway, the War Scout has a rotation leg right here. See, rotation right here. The leg goes up and down like so. You have that. And then we have its claws. Moves up and down. With the wiggle. Because, you know, it's all, it's, all, it's all jointed. It's all jointed, right? These, if I wanted to put fangs in here or something, you know, it can move up and down, too. And then you have its, um, movable tail, its, um, its head, its back of its abdomen head, which, you know, it could be a tail, you know, you know, it can move up in time. These are really, these are just really claw for, like, display purposes. And then, you know, you have this piece that can turn and get you, so, um, you know, they want to get you from the head. Kind of like how, like, um, was it the white hybrid king? And if you don't know what I'm talking about, um, it's one of the predator hybrid thing it's part of the white series aliens the white group where like it's like all like um all of them created by um the whole they had the dna of humans predators you know it's all mixed together so we had like different ones with all the traits of us 
which is pretty neat because you know like you know like the, the standard ones like kind of like xeno completely but white and then but they like they had eyeballs the demonic eyeballs and like they were smart they were like in, sentient enough to actually use guns and all that and still have all the, the advantages of xenos and they, i thought that was pretty cool the fact you can just fight still fight with your hands anyway another form the scout got is its crawler form which i became a true form after realizing how loose it was in this form you know the little back edges are more of back feet and fins while these are like front limbs that help balance it in our claws though it can it can balls up like a bear at times but it doesn't really work and this actually becomes a full-on tail this form is interesting as you can see so yeah we might get to see that in action but yeah that's the entity on that the being and this is war scout did and they all had the like separate forms um there's nothing really much to say i just put them put some together just for like um purposes and whatnot and then i had added on to him for like some type of power so you have that to worry about So, yeah, that's the being. And you know, we've seen its ultimate form, and we've seen its separate form, its spout form, and then we've seen the ultra form on that. And, you know, we got that. Now, if you want scale wise, it's still within like this. So, some that will still pump like a fight against them. Or whatnot. But, like I said, I'm going to use some pieces to amplify them. One of the goals to make the legs more appealable. So, um, you got that. But, um, that's it, really. Oh, I built the base, I guess, if y'all want to see. So I'll be putting them down, putting troops up in different places, and I'll probably have some display features with them moving. So be ready to see that. I might move the predators away from the guard, so I can have, or at least one of them, to have the way for them to have the blast. Because I want to have like the sub bases like now, which means I might actually move the beasts from where I have them to shelves, move them lower because the bases can be up here close to the Xenos. I might do that. Anyway, but yeah, so, um, hmm. Well, I got time. There's nothing really to say. It's just not that. Um, so I'll go ahead and upload this, and then the next video will be, um, the few, the ghoul fusions. So instead, so whenever I do that, that I won't be calling it, I'll be, it won't be making just custom ghouls. It'll be like, um, making just ghoul fusions and whatnot. And then seeing how all my space pops up, I'll probably I'll probably get ready to buy another shelf after I get like all the uh, um series six breakout beasts. I also I don't know I don't know where the Fang Frost is going. So I haven't seen the images of. Though looks like the next thing that will be popping up is um spirit series two. So I'll I'll be getting ready to collect those. I'll probably only decide to get four or three of them. Four or three of them. You know, around those numbers of the series, better series, series too. Fang Frost set. I don't know what's going on with that. Don't know what's holding that up. Um, I do know I'm going to get. I am planning to get like that mini dragon or big smaller dragon, that or whatnot. Um, now I don't know why I keep. I'm probably keeping that form, but you know, you know, we might see him be turned into a custom. No, no, I'll keep him that form. And when now, oh, actually. Hmm. Actually, you know, I could. Yeah, actually, you know, I can, I can, I, can, I might as well review other things because you know, what? instead of like four separate small videos, I can just go ahead and get these out the way. I'm just going because this because so I can have this okay so I can just show some other creatures I guess. All right, so first we got this creature, which I don't know what to um, you know, is this like a demon 
we're just gonna put like the being make sure like being and beast and creatures you know i don't have to put custom or i might put custom like highlights but you know we got this i still don't plan to be too um too long and whatnot but um but yeah i don't know what's going on with that claw so i don't know what's going on also this was gonna be my like my beyond form for dragon force for my dragon slayer like what dude originally i was gonna have what he could transfer the, the dragon and like or like have like a rare dragon form but instead of like transforming dragon like other stuff or like how the werewolves i, I decided to take more ideas from like how the werewolves and like things work Wonder Woman, there's no tails and we just get advantages advantages so i was like all right so this would be like what like, like a word dragon dude would look like he was transformed to a reptile but that wouldn't it had the form of the dragon but he wouldn't have like the tail and whatnot and then i had it where um y'all remember how i was having the um the dragon slayer turn his limbs into elements like the, the ore piece well you know i was gonna have this his upper form but i decided to have to be separate except they still have times when i have him turn i was gonna have him um what you call it if i can find the piece ah here we go I'm doing one arm because I'm just adding this all along because the video is short and I don't know what happened out oh, there they are okay so what well, well, that, that that happened is um if I, oh come on but what I have ha happened is I would have this pop up And I'll have his change. They'll be able to morph his limbs into the ore piece too. And I can I can still have this happen at random if I want. Though mainly I'll be keeping it in the beast form, but you know I might have random poses or whatnot. So yeah, and it's still and this can definitely work better, especially seeing how these are like full on limbs. The whole effect. Dang it, I didn't mean to have that part pop off. But you know, that's that's just that. But um yeah. I I guess I can give you more of a tour of that creature and then I'll end the video there. Anyway, but like yeah, so we have this, which you know, based on it's just really the remnant hunter her body, and then you know I have like a joint and hand and you know the head can move and hunt down prey and get the flapping wings which this went through like different trial and error forms so i got some that i actually enjoy which was more harpy like but i wanted to be more more But yeah, so yeah, we got the little dragon. Uh, maybe I'll just dub that as a Draco. Or whatnot. And uh, yeah, so we have that. And I think that's cool. So yeah, the next video will be like um, a ghoul. The ghoul fusion form. I'll do all three of them. Do all forms in the same video. Um, and then... And I guess... I guess that'll be it. I might do a game video later on today. No promises. If anything, I think I'll probably save a lot of the game videos or whatnot. Or any, like, videos after the ghouls. Maybe after... Maybe around more close to Spring Break. Because, like I said, I'm not going to be buying the Breakout Beast um, until, like, after Friday. Mm, and I think this is the last week until Spring Break. Next week's the last week of March, I think. Or is it the week after? And so, probably all the main videos will be done. Because, like, we're not going nowhere. So, it'll be probably be done during spring break. So, I'll probably play some more games, videos, get those up. Or whatnot. And, like, get some more um, figure videos. And, you know, and by, hopefully by then, you know, more stuff will be out for me to purchase. Um, but, not, but, yeah, I don't know what, how the lines are. So far, I, don't, I think all the offsets are, like, not being bought or whatnot created. Because... You know, now everything looks like it's not being able to be ordered. Not the two dragon pack, not the fang cross set. Beast Lair never once got an image. I mean, so I don't know. So 
So yeah, that that that's it for now. Um, you'll be getting a video later on. Well, not a video today. Um, so like, subscribe, show your friends, and as always, let the chaos guard you.